What is going on guys? It is shoot 'em up here and looky what we have here guys. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That looks so sexy. It is the diamond peacekeeper and I haven't seen any diamond YouTube, well at least from my people that I'm subscribed to, um, gameplays like diamond peacekeeper gameplays. So this is the first, probably for most of you, maybe not all of you, but it is awesome nevertheless. I actually... I didn't really get this thing that fast comparatively to whenever the map packs came out. I should have got it yesterday, but I was gone all day yesterday. I didn't get to play Call of Duty until uh, it was about 12 or 1 in the morning. So it was a while, and there was a nice fail on like, the potential quad, which is retarded. But uh, anyways, guys, in this video, I kind of want to um, let you guys know what are my opinions for the um, for and my initial opinions on the map packs. I kind of totally lost my train of thought there. Um, it was pretty freaking crazy. This isn't an amazing gameplay, by the way. It's just the first game that I play with the Peacekeeper. Diamond, all, I actually have um, one or two actual good ones. Like, I almost, I failed on a nuclear on grind. I failed, failed really hard um, on it. Uh, but anyways, my initial impressions on this map are, uh, for this map in particular, grind is fantastic. I really, really enjoyed this map. Um, the way I play it is I really don't stick, I don't really don't, um go to the center of the map where BDOM is because you're more than likely going to die because there's somebody head glitching somewhere or something you know you're you're more than likely going to die there's a, a lot greater of a chance a lot greater of a chance <laughs> if you uh kind of stick to the outskirts outskir like I am right now and uh, I just kind of refrain from going down the middle of the map now as far as the other maps what are they called downhill um I, can, I, I really don't remember much of the other maps, but uh, I or I think Mirage is one of them. But in my opinion, this map grind is is my favorite. It's the best. I don't like the other maps much at all. I kind of downhill is okay sometimes, but if they're camping in one of those windows, watching B Dom, it is such a pain in the butt to play that map. You know, it with maps and stuff, it really it kind of depends on the players, but this map right here I usually I play better most of the time um, even if I'm playing against better players but on the other maps if they're just sitting back I, like I don't know what to do I mean there's a lot less ways to flank them on here um, you can I totally I'm losing my train of thought like every five seconds I don't know what it is but I haven't done a regular commentary in a while so that that could be it but um there's just the flanking spots. I just find that it takes 10 years to flank somebody on downhill, which is one of the reasons why I don't like it. Because you know, if I'm trying to stick to the outskirts of the map um, on downhill, it's gonna it's gonna be a really slow gameplay. So I don't really like it that much. Um, I do stick to the map to the middle of the map on downhill some because I like to defend the beat on flag, and I actually have a little strategy that which spawn rapes the heck out of people on downhill which is it's really awesome and also on hydro hydro what I would say is my second favorite of these maps um, it's just it's really 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 symmetrical and I like that about it um, nine times out of ten symmetrical maps are people's favorites so hydro could end up being one of my favorite maps um, including grind grind is just freaking awesome um, but on hydro guys if you didn't know like you can spawn kill people on hydro so freaking bad it is like seriously ridiculous it kind of, I think it needs to be patched soon because you can you can stay in this one section I'll, I'll show a gameplay for you guys uh, sooner or later in like a day or two um or well, probably later tonight or tomorrow <laughs> because I really I just want to post gameplays for of this map pack because I do enjoy it but um I think it's Mirage I think it's called Mirage I really have no clue um, it's the sandy map. I don't know why the heck I'm thinking of Mirage, but that's what I'm thinking of. If it's wrong, I'm sorry. But uh, Downhill and Mirage are my two least favorite. Mirage is just freaking... Uh, I don't like it. There's too many places to camp on that map. Too many places to camp. Um, I like Grind and... What the heck is it called? Hydro. And as far as the Peacekeeper goes, I'm going to make a little best setup video type thing because this gun is horrible if you're not using the right attachments and or perks so I probably will make one of those um, a gameplay and talking about my 
attachments and perks and everything else about that. But if you're wondering what I'm using in this gameplay, I'm using the silencer, the stock, and extended mags. It's normally with a 30. It's normally got a 30 round magazine, but with extended mags, it's got 40. And I'm really loving this for rushing around. Like, really, really loving You guys know that I like uh, all the perks and attachments and stuff. Uh, but anyways, guys, that's the end of this video. First impressions of this map pack is like half good, half bad. I haven't played Zombies yet, so I'm not going to talk about that because I want to do a live com on it. Um, but I like half the map, two of the maps, and I don't like two of the maps. And the Peacekeeper, um, I'm loving it at medium range. But anyways, guys, that's the end of this video. Again, I won't show you guys the rest of this, but I uh, hope you guys did enjoy it. Check out my next video. There's going to be more stuff about the Revolution map pack, and I will see you guys later. You never seen anybody in the scene that could hold a track down like this. Like this.